I, I hope you all appreciate this. A hundred days ago, James O'Keefe was experiencing board fights and all that. Everyone knows the story. It's all out there. A hundred days later, James O'Keefe is laying shots on target against a $10 trillion company. That's unbelievable. To be able to get the reporters, to get the story out there. I mean, th this guy is, is a magician. James, you are picking the biggest enemies. You could, you could go lower. You could just kind of do a Fetterman thing here. That's important, but you're going after the institutions, James. What motivates you, and are you afraid? I choose not to be afraid. It's terrifying, Charlie, and I think you know what I mean. There's, you know, to quote the scene from Apocalypse Now, behind every, behind every, inside every human heart, there's a line that kind of separates good and evil. And there's some evil, and a lot of people, even good people out there, have a temptation to be evil. So it's terrifying, the world that we're living in. However, I don't really pick these stories. They pick me. And there's nobody else that's really willing or able or, or in, put in a position the way that I've been put in. And I think the biggest the biggest reason why I'm so attacked is because I, I can't be controlled. People really want to control me. And they're threatened by the fact that I cannot be controlled. So I, I, I've, I've, um, I've leaned into that. Rather, rather than give in or compromise on my core tenants, I, I've just I've just run towards the fire. For people out there that are afraid, you walk through this. Here you are. You've exposed Pfizer, exposed BlackRock, exposed Fetterman, which I just found to be hilarious. Previously, you've done DHS, HHS, Act Blue, which is a huge story. What's your advice to the person out there? I am afraid. I am afraid. James O'Keefe. Um, I would say, what, are you, what exactly are you afraid of? If you're afraid, understand that one day, you know, that heart in your chest will stop beating. We're all gonna die, all gonna die. And I've lived a hundred lives in my 38 years on this planet. I, I have been so fortunate to see and experience so many things that have strengthened me. And, and I think suffering is part of life. Pain is part of life. It's part of the human condition. But, I, I, but it, it really, um, it, it's good for your soul to to tell the truth and and to live not by lies as Solzhenitsyn once famously Alexander said it, it's a great that's correct a great thing for for the human soul to live not by lies and i encourage everyone to not live by lies i hope the conservative movement takes notes because a lot of people on the right are afraid of blackrock and pfizer james o'keefe is not and he's exposing the deeds of darkness which i believe is one of the most virtuous and biblical things a human being can do. God bless you, James O'Keefe. Check it out, O'KeefeMediaGroup.com.